Hello guys, this is Tech Xrena and today we're showing you how to convert your Raspberry Pi into a pirate radio. Uh, I came across this amazing uh, repository on uh, GitHub that's by Make Magazine. It's called Pirate Radio. It helps you to convert your Raspberry Pi into a pirate radio. So the first thing we need to do is have a few audio files. These are my audio files. Now I've converted the first audio file into a dot .wav format. Every audio file which is to be fed to this uh, application, this one is to be a dot .wav file. Uh, if you have any audio files in other formats, please download a converter and uh, convert files into dot .wav format. The next thing we need to do is send this file to Raspberry Pi. So open FileZilla. Enter your IP address here. That is the IP address of Raspberry Pi. The username, password and port will be 22 in case of SSH. Now I've already configured it so I don't need to do that, I just enter the password. Now that is done, I've created this directory called Pilot Radio. This has to be copied here. So it's taking some time. Uh, by then we'll uh, start our party session. Where is it? Okay, so here's it. We enter our IP address 192.168.2.176 and the username before that. Press OK. It will be asking for my password. Okay, now we can see that uh, this is our pirate radio, so we do CD. Pirate radio in caps. Wait, something's wrong. Okay. Now we press ls. You can see that the audio files here. And this is done. Yep. Successfully transferred. So we'll just close FileZilla. We don't need it now. Next thing we'll do is uh, download Git. Now to copy this, uh, it's a long process otherwise, so an easier process will be downloading git. On uh, Raspbian OS you can type sudo apt get install uh, git and press enter. It will be asking do you want to download stuff. You press uh, y and enter and it will download install. On uh, Arch Linux you type pacman minus s space uh, audio file, oh, I'm sorry, space git. And then you download install. As soon as that is done, you uh, type git space clone space you copy the link here copy the clipboard now you paste it here press enter now in case it gives some error uh, saying that certificates were not validated or something like that you need to change the time and date uh, so you can google for that or you can type time date ctl space time and then your y y y four y's two m two d and then h h m m and uh, s s so this is basically uh, the year two zero one four twenty and uh, sorry two zero one four six zero six that is then twenty here then seventeen thirty three and zero zero here so this is how you set time date in uh, Arch Linux. We just clear this. You can see that we typed git space clone space pirate radio and this is here. We just go into pirate radio. Now open Chrome again. You can see that this pifm file you can just open it. Now it gives you the commands to run. Now G++ is basically a uh, compiler that is uh, what do you say GNUC compiler yeah that's GCC or G++ it doesn't matter. You can install it by typing uh, pacman minus s gcc on a Arch Linux system. On a uh, Raspbian system, you can type sudo apt get install gcc. It'll install as soon as that is done. You can run this command. So for that, just copy this. Right click here, press enter. Now gcc will actually compile the dot the pifm file and convert it into pifm, which is mentioned there it will basically overwrite the existing file as soon as that is done we will be ready to broadcast now that is done we will clear this go back cd double dot stands for 
changing directory to the previous one where our uh, audio file was there. Now we will uh, MB audio file to pilot radio. Okay, now I had another file, so I'll be copying that into the same directory as well just to show you the difference. That is in. Uh, Here it is. It's copying right now. Okay, it is done. Okay, now we are supposed to run our file using the command which is mentioned here. We'll just paste this here and I'll explain it to you. Now dot slash stands for current directory. So this means that in the current directory, PIFM is the file which you are supposed to uh, play. And now the uh, command line arguments are an input file. This is the dot wave file, the frequency, the sample rate, and stereo or mono. That is, uh, doesn't matter. OK, so now we'll change the input file to our play file first. Bleh. Now 103.3 is the frequency at which the Raspberry Pi will be broadcasting, so change it according to your uh, local stations. I mean, don't mess with other stations. And uh, 22050 is the sample rate, so let's uh, keep it as it is. Sample rate basically is the amount of uh, frames will be playing per second. So if you increase it, the speed of uh, playing will increase. That will be like fast forward, and if you uh, go on decreasing, decreasing it, the that will be like slow motion play so we just pre press enter and it will start broadcasting this file at 103.3 .3 frequency now uh, I'll be using my phone to scan the whole network make sure that your phone while any device which you're scanning is uh, very close to the Raspberry Pi because this does not have an antenna so that will be a problem for it, for it. you can de design an antenna and then transmit properly so that's not a problem now I'm scanning right now with my phone I'll be placing the earphones close to the mic so you can hear. This is pretty slow so I'll just press Ctrl C and then uh, increase the sample rate so let's keep it about 30,000 and as soon as I press enter the audio starts playing. As you can see now the uh, speed has increased. Similarly with another file Let's change it to audio 1. Now let's play. Now you can see this is very fast. So what I'll do is I'll decrease the sample rate drastically. The problem with decreasing the sample rate is the less number of samples, the le uh, less the quality of the signal which is broadcasted. So um, try if you can keep the sample rate up. If you can't, then it's all right now you can hear something right so this is how to broadcast using raspberry pi you can find more details on the link this make magazine link i'll be posting it on my uh, description so this is it guys thank you like and subscribe